you can play though wanna hang with me i'm not really looking for a friend so spend your time with me I'm looking for someone not afraid of give it all to me good morning i am waking up in sunny south africa and it's my birthday i'm 28 years old um but I kind of like that number, 28 in 2020. Anyway, today's plan is going to be a bit of an adventure. And then um, after today, I'm going to be starting my South Africa vlog. So we've only actually been here for two days so far. But loving it so far. It is nice and sunny and glorious. And today is going to be an adventure day with me and Tom. We've got a car. We're going to go round exploring. I think we want to go to Boulders Beach to see the penguins and then he has something planned later on this evening so yay if you're not already following me on instagram freya farrington one i have been doing daily updates on my instagram stories and then highlighting them under the cape town highlights if you want to see more of what we've been getting up to then be sure to head over there and see that if you are new please do subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you're a fan of the birthday vlogs and travel vlogs and let's get on with today's adventure <laughs> we're reunited are you sad you're not going to cricket today yeah. happy birthday thank you We're just currently having a bit of a drive around, taking in the scenery. I think we're going to go via Hope Bay, Colk Bay. I sure told you about that. Um, what's it called where the penguins are? Boulders Beach. And what have we got planned for tonight? Can I guess? Yeah. Is it to do with the leaflet you picked up off the car the other day? No. Is it? No. What was it, like an open cinema? The first guess. You were so bad. Well, like, you could say maybe. Yeah, Not but, telling you. Yeah, but then you know what it was. <laughs> Jungle Book. Is it actually? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Aww. So we, we have an adventure day planned. That's what we've done. We've got a car. We're just going to drive around. We've got Maps Me on the go. If you remember from the, the wrong bastard, Barbados vlog. How did it send you the wrong way? Something to a different different place. A different president? Well, a different, no, it won't recognise president for a start. Bloody maps me. So how did you find it then afterwards? Uh, how did I find it then afterwards? I put it in my Google Maps instead. Alright. Some data. Yeah, Tom's actually, what have you done? You've got a SIM card out here so that he's got data out and about rather than like me, I just have to be connected to Wi-Fi. So right now we are in an area called Kirsten Bosch. And we're actually driving down the west coast and then we're going to come up back on the east coast. So yeah, we're just enjoying the drive down. This is Hope Bay Beach here at the top. And the scenery is beautiful, isn't it? Lots of mountains. We're saying it's hikers paradise. There seems to be quite a lot of people, a lot of cyclists and hikers and my hair's gone up because, well, it'll be up for the rest of the day probably. Uh, there's a lot of straight roads for them to all just follow, so there's loads of runners, cyclists. It's making me feel quite unfit really, I'll be honest. Look at this guide, absolutely pounding. Like marathon training. It's, it's oh, look, a riding centre, horse riding. Swim with some penguins. <laughs> That's my birthday aim of today. 500 meters slide right, then slide right. Slide right, then slide right. Question is, have you got change? So we're along this Chapman's Peak Drive, which is stunning. And we were just saying how the quality of the roads were really good. Um, but there is a toll to pay, but that's fine. £2.50. £2.50. I'm on the edge. <laughs> wow, look at this. We just stopped midpoint. This is the view from the other side for Hope Bay. Hope Bay. Hope Bay. Wow, it's so 
pretty. Oh, you can see all the boats and everything. So we've come to a place called Camel Rock, um, near Fishhook I think it's called, that's the area. Oh, okay. oh and there's loads of fluffy dogs here. Look at this one. It's like an Alsatian like. Alsatian retriever mix moment, we've seen two golden retrievers here. Oh that might have been the tail of the other, what I thought was a golden retriever actually. Smile. Since 1963. Well, it's been here since 1963, that's the year my mum was born. What are we having? Oysters? No. I don't think you do. I did see pancakes. I mean, I had a big breakfast, but Tom's not eaten yet, so... Uh, maybe just share a bit of whatever you'll have. It's going to be like, I think that's deep fried mashed potatoes. I want you to taste it on camera. We've ordered a traditional African dish, which is called, what was it? Pap, pap and clay. No, pap, pap en vlay or something. Pap en clay. Pap en vlay. Let's just give it a little taste. Mm. I can see why it's not necessarily the best for you. Nice. It's quite creamy. I'll see what she means by the creaminess of it. Got a bit of a kick to it. Is there meat in there? Is that it? It's like chicken. Like chicken, in fact it is chicken. Oh is it? Just like chicken. <laughs> Yum. Wait, before you set off, we need to set up out today. You got enough there. Tom's hunted these down, which if you come to Cape Town, find them. Norma's crunchies. So update, we're just kind of en route back now, but just deciding what to do for food before we go to the open air cinema tonight, which isn't until quite a bit later. So I think we'll get some food beforehand. And we've just driven through a place called Colk Bay which is it's quite pretty. Quite out there, I yeah, I mean, we're on a Saturday, so it's quite busy everywhere. We were just saying maybe a, a weekday might have been better, but um, that looked quite nice. And then, yeah, just kind of heading back in the direction. Boulders beat. Penguins. Shit. Tom didn't like it. I'm glad we did it, but I do think it should just be free. Wait, you can't swim with them or anything. I thought you might have been able to swim with them. No, you can't. You've made that up. I'm sure I've read it somewhere, you but I wasn't 100% sure that you could swim with them. If you could have, I would have. Um, and yeah, so it was a little bit underwhelming, but I'm still glad I saw them. I'd say there was about But it was 16 penguins. pounds to go. It's what? 18 penguins. 18? 18, 18, yeah, I was gonna say 18. 18. Yeah, probably 80 to 100 penguins. They have probably most definitely been bred there to stay there. No, they pretty much just stayed on the beach, a couple in the water, and there was the surrounding beaches didn't have any penguins on, so you definitely, not that I could see anyway, swim with them. Not that, I don't know if you would anyway, if they're pooing everywhere and they did smell a little bit. 
To be honest with you, it's like going to see the ducks in uh, Victoria yeah. Park. So it's like seeing the South African version of a duck. Um, but it was, it was alright. I'm glad we'd done the road trip there and doing that garden route down. You don't drive 45 minutes just to go though. And no, I wouldn't say if you're staying in Cape Town to go all the way, do a full road trip down the garden route and see all that first. That isn't a full garden route though. Like no, but that that route yes. down the west, yes. never eat shredded wheat, west coast, yes. and then come back up the east. That's what we're doing now, we're on route back. Yes. That's our update. We're having a lovely birthday so far. Penguins rubbish. No, they are cute. But just a little bit underwhelming. I like animals. So we've been dog spotting quite a lot. Pick and pay. There's loads of these pick and pays about. And they are their like supermarket version. So we just popped into one to stock up on some water, some snacks. That's where we got the enormous cookies. I still need to try one of them. Oh. And try one. Uh, where are they? Change your life. You'll never have a flapjack again. Flapjack is it? Well, Crunchies, they're called. So Tom got three packets. Obviously, a fan. Do you want a bit? I've never said no to a crunchy. Why would you do that? You're gonna break my camera, Tom. That would be good. Idea. No, it's not funny. <laughs> I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Thank you. This isn't where we're going though, is it? No, we're going to Paul, it's like an hour away. We're at a place called Kirstenbosch. And there is a botanical gardens here. It was en route, so we thought we'd pop in and have a look. So we've had a slight change of plan. We were gonna to go to those gardens, but we think that the mums would quite like it, so we asked about um, the ticket and how long you can spend in there and they sort of said anywhere from like three to four hours, which we don't have before we need to start heading back to go to the cinema later. So as a result of that, we think we might come back here another day um, to the gardens and do that with the mum. So that'll be in the South Africa vlog if you wanted to see that. We have arrived at a place called Nelson Wine Estates and this is gonna end pretty much my birthday because we'll be here till late and this is the open air cinema. You wanna video it, the cinema? What? You wanna video the cinema? Oh yeah, I will, but I mean, as in this is sort of the ending point to our birthday day vlog. Should we quickly get in there? Huh? Should we quickly get in there? Yeah, let's get in there. Bring the, um... I'll bring the water, the, and the cookies. Of and then my linen jacket, you can take your hoodie. Probably get cool pretty quick. Let's go. So I can already see one on the moon behind us. So hopefully we're gonna get amazing views of the stars. So it's very romantic. Thanks for booking. 